I'm not going to agree to a deal that protects wealthy tax sheets and crypto traders while putting food assistance at risk for nearly 100, well, I assume nearly 1 million Americans. And it's time for Republicans to accept that there is no bipartisan deal to be made solely, solely on their partisan. That was your president lying. Can you imagine being an American taxpayer that happens to enjoy trading crypto assets, maybe buying them, whatever that may be, or just even investing, okay? We have to pay taxes, okay? I pay my crypto taxes. I pay all of my taxes. But can you imagine the president of the United States of America coming out and saying that crypto traders are billionaires and don't pay their taxes? The IRS's guidelines for crypto taxes is an absolute mess. And most people over at the IRS don't even understand how this stuff works. But it's their job to be in charge of telling you what you need to pay or actually going after you for not paying properly. We do not have any clear guidelines for crypto assets in the United States of America. If there's no clear guidelines for crypto assets in the United States of America, how can we properly pay our taxes. Take a step back, hear what I said, and let that sink in. Now the President of the United States of America is not only lying, but indicating that you, me, and other people who happen to like crypto assets are breaking the law. I don't know about you guys, but I've paid over six figures in taxes for, I don't even know how long now, yearly, okay? I pay my taxes the best of my ability. I hire somebody to tell me how much I owe in my taxes and I'm doing the best that I can. In this video of President Biden, is basically indicating that you don't pay your taxes. You don't wanna pay your taxes. And because of the, but the deficit that we're seeing in the United States of America, because of their poor spending, not just him, but both sides, we are being under attack. Okay. It also was leaked earlier that the Democrats do not want any type of positive regulation for crypto. They basically want to ban it, which is kind of bizarre because you would think you would want to kind of bring in a industry that could raise revenue for more social programs. Because let's face it, with crypto being legalized or some sort of guidelines taking place, more taxpayer dollars. That way you can have better schools, better roads, all of these things. But these people do not want it. And again, this is why I am voting for somebody who is pro crypto. I don't care if they are red, I don't care if they're blue. A lot of these social issues are gonna end up fixing themselves. But again, another problematic thing is, what are these 1 million Americans that are going without food because of crypto traders? I don't know about you guys, but because of crypto, I've actually been able to donate a lot more money to different organizations that makes sense for me in Los Angeles, California. And I know a lot of you have done the same as well. A lot of you have donated to different causes that I've talked about. The House of Ruth, the Self Care Lab, etc. Without crypto, I wouldn't be able to do that. So before you listen to what this guy is saying, take a step back and really think about it. Because not only is he lying, but he's using our industry as a way to push his agenda to get people to not like crypto or to think that crypto is bad. And I also want to remind you guys, crypto can be tracked. Every single transaction is on the blockchain. Okay. I think one of the reasons why they do not want crypto to be legalized or to bring a level playing field in the U.S. for crypto is because they know that their behavior will be tracked as well their salaries, where they spend their money, and the money that they're receiving from other people. It's all public on the blockchain. But again, they want to institute a CBDC along with UBI, which is absolutely dangerous to American ideology of capital or non-corporate capitalism and entrepreneurism. Remember, that's how America was built. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and of course, set alerts for more mic drop truth bonds. Bye-bye, babes.